What a crazy episode, guys. So, uh, to wrap this episode up, which is uh, like episode number five of Moon Levers, welcome, guys. Um, first, <laughs> I've watched episode six before five, so you might notice when... Um, you might not, but uh, I... Like, when you watch the review of episode number six, have in mind that I did not watch episode number five. Um, it felt very okay, cause we kind of jumped to the death of uh, Jesus' cousin, but honestly, <sighs> I mean there was something missing. But I was like, okay, maybe they want us, don't want to tell us. But yeah, we saw more about like this whole mm, thing between Hesu, her cousin, and the eighth prince. And now I can understand episode number six even more, like how it came to, yeah, how they were talking, like the talk with um, the prince and uh, the talk with uh, Hesu. Um, then Hesu's cousin uh, was also uh, talking to the empress with like the wish to let Hesu. Um, marry the the prince. Uh, that was kind of kind of wild, um, cause she was very sure that they loved each other and maybe they do, but it wasn't that obvious all along. For me, it still could be the oh, good old brother sister um, relation. Um, I mean, in some regards. I mean, they kind of stepped over the boundary, of obviously, but um, they still could come go back to that. And um, also, um, yeah, now I understand why the prince in episode number six had, um, like, with the thing that he couldn't tell her how much he loved her and how they played it out at the end. Oh, shit, dude. That was crazy. Um, what else? Hmm, right, we had like Hesu, uh, like having contact with uh, Chingmu, the uh, constellation dude, um, who was like the secretary for the king kind of dude, um, and he seemed to know from the past um cause like alone on off the line uh when you are in Koryo, play like the people like or play as the people in Ko Koryo, Kopio, Kopio. I know. I literally forgot that. <laughs> um But yeah, o like this whole episode um, this whole episode oh like right we had like her answer to the um, to the poem with her like uh, drawing the smiley that was so sweet very very cute um Oh, and the talk, yeah, between the eight friends and Hesu there was crazy as well. Um, though, like, those both, also interesting chemistry, as always. And, yeah, they played that out, like, the story played it out very well. She once, for the last time, wanted to get, be, be beautiful, so she got the makeup overhaul from Hesu and... <sighs> had a last walk with the prince. <sighs> and I really liked her character. I can tell I tell you that now. She was such a nice character. She also She also seemed like a catalyst for like has a story to 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 be fully in, like to 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 integrate her fully into the story. 
um, to make her an important character. Uh, but she herself was such an important character as well. And she will have an... I, I'm sure she will have an effect uh, even in even in like 10 more episodes she will still be there uh, in the mines and uh, yeah she might come back through some back back um, like some how do you say that like when they are thinking about the past and just stuff right Backflashes, flashbacks, flashbacks, <laughs> flashbacks. Uh, she might be come back uh, through some flashbacks and stuff, cause she's such an important character. And also, I'm very in uh, impor like interested in how much uh, she might support Hesu now, cause like of the wish, um, like that they had there. Um, I'm really curious about that, cause I really like her as well. Um. She's still looking at uh, on the things uh, on a empress standpoint. In the end, um, but besides that, she's very very supportive. So yeah, let's see, let's see how this is going to continue, guys. Thanks for watching with me this episode. Um, it was very very very. Um, nice to watch that with you. It was such an important episode, and I'm so happy that I watched that and did not just miss it out because apparently there was nothing to miss for me. It seemed like it. Uh, on the other hand, I had a slight feeling that there might be more to the death of her, and it was. It really was. So, guys, write me in the comments what do you think about this episode. Uh, if you watch this here on YouTube, don't forget to check out my Patreon. Link to that in the description. And besides that, guys, thanks for watching uh, this video and write me yeah, in the comments what you think and see you hopefully in the next episode. Bye, guys.